I am just super excited to work. I kind of want to get called today. Morning, guys. It is 11 o'clock right now, and today is June 7th. And guess what? Today is my first day on reserve. My reserve time is from 2 o'clock p.m. to 2 o'clock a.m. So I slept pretty late so I have, you know, just in case I get called, I'll be ready to work and I have my bag there already packed. My red bag here is all set to go. I just signed up for the Advantage Cash which is a program in our company to make extra cash while you're in flight and it's totally super easy to do. I actually passed the test and I got a hundred. <laughs> it's only 10 questions so I got 10 questions correctly. Yeah, you only need to get I think 8 out of 10. It's super easy to, to pass the test so I got my certificate right here. That was my priority to do today so now I'm just gonna organize more of all my stuff here that has been waiting for me here since when I was training like males. I gotta open a lot of males and all that good stuff and just keep organized because with this job you have to be always always organized and if you notice I'm charging my um it's not jetpack my jet no tablet <laughs> they call that tablet but it's like a literally it's a phone but it's they call it tablet so that's what I'm gonna be using for my job that's like super important everything is in that tablet so I want to make sure I got a hundred percent charge. I am just super excited to work. I kind of want to get called today. I really made a decision with Papa to stay here, but now I'm kind of like I wish I have an option also to stay in Boston. So I'm gonna, you know, hopefully you could find like a bed, uh, what do you call it, a crash pad where I can just stay there when I am on reserve. We're just pretty much just like three four days max I think every week so I can stay there for three to four days and then stay here on my days off or travel or maybe even stay here on my reserve days and I just want to have that option but for now my only option really is to take the bus actually I have two options to take the bus and or drive but if I drive I'm gonna have to pay for my parking because I choose the option to get paid from the company for my bus uh, fee so they pay part of it which is pretty good amount so uh, I get about I think I get $125 out of whatever I spend um, for the bus I bought the one month pass but now I learn I can actually just buy the um, the six pass for like $77 and just keep buying it and I think I would end up spending less if I do that but lessons learned you know lessons learned and it's okay, I'm gonna use a lot of it this month because I'm gonna be traveling to see my mom and really to see as much as I can with my day off without, you know, going illegal on my work. I wanna make sure I keep that uh, reputation because I wanna be in great, great terms with this company forever. I really love this company that I am in and I'm super proud to be part of this. So I don't wanna ruin any of that. But anyways, you guys, I'm going to get going here. I still have time. I have three hours before my call time. So I want to be showered, makeup on. I don't know if I want to put makeup. Actually, I'm not really big into um, putting makeup on at this point. Uh, sometimes I'm into it. Sometimes I'm not. But I really just want to be, uh, be ready by the time, you know, by 2 o'clock. So when I get called, I hop in a bus go for my trip and we'll be good that's the situation you guys i'm just so excited i kind of want to get called but if i don't i won't be too busted about it uh i saw my uh my my name in the line i still don't know how to read that but i think i'm i'm way far below the call out so i don't think i'm gonna get called today to be honest with you and again, if I do, I'm still going to be super happy. Um, all right, you guys. Bye. I'll see you later. Have a great morning. Mwah. It is 12, 21 p.m. right now. I finished everything pretty much that I could possibly do in terms of paperwork. And oh, my God. I was just um, talking with one of the um, 
representative from our company and help me out with my, you know, changing my password on one of our systems that I need to log in today and he's super helpful. The people in this company, I am telling you guys, this is only really my first week since graduation, but everyone that I spoke with, I met, every single person, I have nothing to say but great things. They're just amazing. Great, great, great people. So anyways, today is June 7th, and I have mentioned already that this is my day one on reserve day. And if I haven't mentioned, here it is. It's my day one on reserve, you guys. So I am on reserve today from on reserve call from 2 p.m. to 2 a.m. I am super excited. <laughs> I don't know what to expect, to be honest. I don't know if I get call, if I need to drive, or if I'll be able to take the train, uh, not train, the bus. So it's kind of like a gamble because I think I'm going to stay home. Uh, I was planning on, and, you know, before I was planning to go to the airport, like the time of my reserve time. But somebody suggested to me that I don't really need to do that. And she said, worst case, you know, I drive. And if I have to drive, I just drive. But... I think I'll be able to take this, the, the bus because they said when they call you, they give you plenty of time normally. And yeah, that's the risk that I just have to take. If I don't get enough time, I'll just definitely have to drive. And that's still going to take me an hour and a half. So it's still, I'm just going to get ready, you know, before two o'clock, I want to make sure that I'm ready to go all just ready to put on my uniform and leave. So my bag is all set, my red bag is all set. So at this point, it's just really a lot of waiting game and I'm gonna just watch my schedule and see if I have a sequence assigned to me. I hope if I work today, I hope I have a sign a sequence just so I see the time ahead of time. Is that right? <laughs> I see the time that I supposed to report ahead of time. But anyways, you guys, nothing to report yet. Really, just today is a lot of waiting, um, starting two o'clock to two. So we'll see how it goes. <laughs> Excited. All right, you guys, I just thought about this. While I'm waiting, I think I'm going to put in my bed for tomorrow. I'm going to try to look for a sequence that I can pick up for my day off. Because when I pick up something on my days off, it goes, the time that I work on my days off goes on top of my guaranteed time, as far as I understand. So... I really want to go to California to see my mom because she's going to have a uh, surgery on the 13th. So I'm going to try to get a layover on that day, the 13th layover in uh, LAX. So I get to see my mom and at the same time I get to work. So if not, if I don't get one, I already book a flight for me to see her there either way. So, but I'd rather work the flight and be there in California and make extra money and also try to play with my schedule a little bit and see how it goes because I'm still learning and a lot of this stuff is learning by doing. So. All right, you guys, just finished uh, doing my bid for today. I did the same bid as yesterday. So I think I'm gonna keep that. I like the late start, you know? So I did the wrap DCBA, meaning uh, the D is like from 2 p.m. to 2 a.m. The C is, I believe, 10 a.m. to 10 p.m. B is like 4 a.m. to 4 p.m. A is like 2 a.m. to 2 p.m. That's what I did, you guys, and we'll see what I get for my schedule for tomorrow. Um, I'm excited. I don't think I'm going to get called today, but I'm going to go ahead and shower. It's 1.30 p.m. right now. I'm going to shower, get ready for work if I get called. Um, if not, I'm just pretty much gonna hang out here and do all. I still have a lot of stuff that I have to do. Uh, it's not really a priority, but you know, things like I have to put all the numbers, important numbers on my cell phone. I um, think I'm, I'll have time to meal prep today, go back to my normal eating routine. <laughs> and even get to work out probably. Um, on that note, I probably need to work out before I shower. So I think I'm going to go have a little snack, work out, and I'll just watch the call out, you know, page where I can see who's the next one to call. And I'm still fifth 
for that specific, um, s not sequence, for that specific block of time. I think I'm still the number six to be called. So I really don't think I'm, I'm going to get called. So um, if I do, I'm just going to keep watching on my, my schedule and see how it goes. But this is a great process. I love this, you guys. So... I will see you later. Have a great day. It's 9.35 p.m. right now. Still on June 7th. So I didn't get any call. And I don't think they're going to call me because the last flight, I think it was 9 o'clock something. So they're definitely not going to call me right now. But they may call me later. So I don't have to look at my email or anything until 5 o'clock. So... And if they need me there, will just call me. So I'm going to go to bed now. My next day's reserve schedule happened to be on wrap A. And wrap A is 2 a.m. to 2 p.m. So I kind of had like uh, a back-to-back -to -back close together. So it's like a 24 hours reserve time. Normally it's 12 hours. I don't know why I get scheduled 12 hour and then 12 hour like pretty much consecutive close to each other like rap D and rap A because rap D is the last one and then rap A is the beginning so it kind of meets I'm wondering if that's normal or I know it's not a mistake because a few of us had that schedule so I hope this doesn't happen a lot because I don't want to have to be awake for like 24 hours so I'm gonna go to bed because I remember there they told us if it's uh, I think after 9 or something, I don't remember what time, but I know after a certain hours, you don't have to wait for the email. You can just um, wait for the call, so they definitely call, they definitely will call us if, we, if they need us. So at this point, if they call me in the middle of the night, I'm going to have to drive to Boston because uh, C&J doesn't start until 1.30 and get there at 3.15, so I hope that I don't get called for a earlier than... Uh, four o'clock shift or something like that so if it's like a little bit later i will have time to go to cnj all right you guys have a great night so we didn't get called today but that's okay i get to stay home cook did a little meal prep not a lot just kind of like um vegetables and you know side dishes and yeah i'm gonna go to bed now and i'll see you guys tomorrow have a great night this is my look, my life, my love. This is my destiny. This is my destiny. You can sit down with your trouble, but for